okay welcome back so the next thing we are meant to do is to test our app on our phone so to test this app um, very easy all you need to do is to you can actually test it directly through USB you can have an emulator or you can in install AI to app on your phone and use AI companion but I'm going to just bundle it as an APK save it on my system um, after saving it on my laptop I'm going to send it to my phone you know and then install it like you can install every other app then after installation we can easily run a test on it and see how it works so it's very very easy to bundle an Android app from MIT App Inventor okay while we wait for that okay as you can see it's downloading right now so it's done downloading so I'm going to view showing folder where it is currently saved so the next thing I'm going to do is connect my USB cable here and then um, connect this to my laptop so that I can copy it. okay I just okay so let's send it to my laptop so I'm sending it to my laptop uh, my phone sorry so I'm sending it to my phone right now so right now I've sent it to my phone so I'm going to go to files to look for it the name is BLE module right BLE module so let's look for it then install and then do a test BLE module that's it here so I'm going to click to install okay cool is installing right now so I'm going to open it okay that's the app on our phone uh, we must ensure that your Bluetooth is connected uh, for the first time you will be prompted to search for it and then okay that's it here robotics so you click on it then pair okay now don't forget that we have um, our serial monitor open the same way we opened it the last time so right now it's showing connected okay let's just go to the app and find out so I'm going to scan so let me allow so it's scanning all Bluetooth devices right now I got it here robotics so I click on robotics and connect so when I click on connect you can see showing connected here in a serial monitor also showing connected so when I click forward F shows in our serial monitor and I click right you can see R shows here left L shows here back B shows here so it's working very well as you can see it's working very well so let me try to disconnect can you see that it says do you want to disconnect so when I say no it goes back so I can see continue controlling then try to disconnect it again and say yes can you see it says disconnected so clicking nothing will happen the app has um, gone off so I can scan again to connect that's it here robotics I click connect so right now it's connected it's showing connected in a serial monitor so when I click L F R B so it's working very well can see that it's working very well so that's how you can run a test on the app so the next video we're going to do is how we're going to write an Arduino code that will pick this data and take a particular action so we'll meet in the next video